place uh, in Jamaica in 1962, which was actually a time of quite extreme social and political change. It was Jamaican independence, there was the Cuban Missile Crisis, but also Jamaica was emerging as quite a quite a desirable tourist destination. The James Bond film Dr. No had just been made there and the masses of Jamaicans were thinking about whether or not they should move to Canada or in the United States or move to the UK. So there's a lot going on and I wanted to tell the story of how it affected ordinary people at that time but in particular I wanted to focus on the story of women because often it was men who were seen to be at the forefront of change but really there were lots of women in the background and, and their lives were affected too and, and they often had things to say but what they had to say was often not heard. So in the play I actually focus, even though I tell the story a bit about the, you know, the kind of political struggle and what was going on in the background, I really wanted to focus in on the lives of these individual five women and their partners and how their lives changed during that summer.